So you might have microplastics in your brain, but it does not have to stay there. There's lots of really effective ways of getting microplastics out of your body. Here's the good news. Microplastics typically do not build up the way that other compounds do, right? So for example, heavy metals and other compounds like PFAS, those substances can take upwards to 10 years or even longer to leave your body. Microplastics don't show to do that. However, microplastics do show to aggregate in places where there are damaged cells or have more fatty tissue, right? right? A lot of the chemicals that come in microplastics are lipophilic, meaning they're attracted to the fat tissue in your body. And the more the blood pumps through that area, the more vascular that area is, the more it shows that microplastics might accumulate there. So that's why we're starting to see some studies with higher amounts of microplastics in brains and <laughs> testicles. So for the most part, microplastics tend to get out of your body within like 24 to 48 hours. What's also amazing is that there have been many, many studies showing that there are certain things that have been proven to detox microplastics from your body, okay? Probiotics is a big one. And I say probiotics, not like a probiotic pill, but the actual bacterial strains literally proven to detox microplastics from your body. Now, I do not recommend taking a probiotic pill that could be great however you can't necessarily guarantee that those probiotic strains are going to come alive and do the work that they're supposed to do that is why i always recommend eating probiotic rich foods okay aqua kefir literally kombucha lots of soft cheeses fresh peas pickles from the cold aisle real brined olives like from all of my pickle sauerkraut you can even do like quick pickles at home that is going to be fabulous okay and the whole point is getting as many different lactobacillus and bacterial strains as you possibly can. You don't want to get just one. You want to get lots and lots of different kinds, okay? And what's even more amazing is that there's tons of different vitamins and phytochemicals in fresh fruits and vegetables that have also shown to rem remediate the impacts of microplastics as well as detox them from your bodies. Again, there's even more that probably exist that have not been tested. But what we know is that more fresh, unprocessed foods that you get, that is going to ensure that you get as many of the phytochemicals, and vitamins as well as prebiotics that the good bacteria in your stomach want to eat and then that's going to help detox all the microplastics from your body and and fix all the damage that it's done to your body.